Hi everyone, my name is Eric and this is the TwoGuard 1080p dash cam. I'll show you a video from the camera during the day, dusk, and nighttime, and I'll briefly go over why I think having a dash cam is so important for everyone. And I included a link in the description down below where you can pick one of these up for the best price. I got this one for my girlfriend's car. Her previous one claimed to be full HD, but the footage was terrible. You couldn't read license plates, you couldn't read street signs, and it would just randomly stop recording whenever the footage was full, so you'd have to literally get in there and delete everything off the card. What makes this dash cam great for so many people is its low price and high video quality. Now this one came with a 16 gigabyte micro SD card which will record around 128 minutes of footage filming at full HD. You can pick from one, three, and five minute clips and once the card is full it will just start overwriting the oldest files. So you can go through your old footage and pull off the clips of interest that you want to save onto your computer. And you can go all the way up to a 64 gigabyte card if you want to record maybe longer road trips or if you want to save more footage for longer periods of time. You also get a micro USB cord for pulling off footage directly onto your computer. Or you can always just pop out the micro SD card and uh, pop it into your computer that way. Now the power cord is over 12 feet long so you'll have plenty of wire to go along the entire length of your car to the DC power connector which is also known as a cigarette lighter. Now almost every car should have a tiny space to hide the wire along the windshield. You can also test this by taking your cell phone charging wire and tucking it alongside your car's molding to hide the wire. Uh, I just followed my molding all the way down underneath the floor mat and then it came up to the uh, center console to the um, to that DC port there. You can barely tell the wires even there. And this is a test of the mic. I'm just going to do a normal conversation voice. I'm sitting about two feet away from the uh, actual dash cam. Now real quick I'll go over some of the main reasons why I think having a dash cam is a must. There are over 27,000 accidents that occur every day. I wouldn't want to rely on the other driver being an honest person when filling out an insurance claim. And if it ever went to court, that video evidence could save you a ton of money and time. And have you ever had road rage? Did the driver unsafely cut you off and purposely slam on their brakes to try to get you to rear end them? Most states actually have programs where you can report bad drivers in the hopes to make the roads a safer place to drive. And having actual footage to submit is pretty helpful. It's also great if you want to review footage from a new driver, or if you loan a car to a friend, or if you ever drop off your car at a mechanic shop. And you could also use it for some more positive things like recording a beautiful drive during a sunset, maybe while on vacation. And a cool feature about this dash cam is that it'll actually wake itself up briefly to record if it senses vibration. Now overall for a mid-grade dash cam, I was very impressed with the quality of the footage in both daytime and nighttime. Now it is hard to read license plates at night, but that's true really with most dash cams under $100. The problem is, is that license plates are reflective and will cause cameras to overexpose the plate, making it impossible to read. Another problem is the wide angle lens. This one has a 170 degree lens, which is great because it will capture more area in front of the camera, which is what you want, but it will make reading small text on a license plate a little bit harder to do. So that's my review on the TwoGuard Full HD dash cam. If you guys do have any questions, please just leave them in the comments down below. And if you found the video helpful, I always appreciate a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to keep up to date with my future reviews. Thank you so much for watching.